Hey, welcome back to a brand new episode. You're watching K and Kimishu Productions. I'm Kartik, your host, and today in this video, I'm going to teach you how to rig a car inside Blender. And actually, why I'm making this video is I have like already made a video on uh, rigging a car inside Blender back before, but still, I'm making a new video because recently I have noticed a problem that is, if you use the rig a car add on inside the Blender uh, version 4.3.2. You will get this weird uh, message when you try to generate the rig and this happens because the rig card add-on has not been updated for the latest version of the blender so then i i just got a solution uh, not me but there's a youtuber called gene yan 3d and i prefer you i suggest you to go and check out him he's a great great youtuber so yeah um, he just released his own like corrected version of rig card so first of all i will give the link in the description for the uh, rig card add-on and uh, for this video i'm gonna use this beautiful this amazing car model which i got from blender kit and all the credits uh, goes to the respective artist all you need to do is you need to make sure that your car model is facing in the exact axis of the default monkey that is our suzanne so if you just uh, import suzanne like shift a and import suzanne and check if the uh, if your car model is facing in a wrong direction so now let's drag select the entire car and shift s cursor to selector then shift a add an empty drag select the entire car and deselect the empty then by holding shift select the empty and click ctrl p ctrl p parent and make sure you click the object keep transform then click the empty go to object go to apply apply all transform then we have to add empties for each wheels and make sure your wheels are separated like in this case my wheels are not separated all the wheels like uh, two wheels are joined uh, together so what i will do is i will go to the edit mode and i will uh, select each wheels and by clicking p i can select separate by loose parts and let, like let me do this uh, real quick and i will get back to you Now as you can see my wheels are separated now let's <coughs> assign empties for each wheels so make sure the cursor is in the center of the wheel uh, which you are uh, using so in this case i am selecting this wheel and let's go to edit mode and click a to select all the vert vertices click shift s and cursor to selected then shift a add an empty and do the same process for each wheels <coughs> like select the wheel go to edit mode and a for selecting the all vertices and shift s to uh, like cursor to selected and shift a to add an empty and let me do this real quick and i will get back to you and now we can see we, we got all the empties at the center of each wheels now we need to parent each wheels to their respective empty objects so for that i, I will just hide each uh, part of the wheels so like Clicking off, uh, clicking off each wheels and clicking H for hiding it and clicking Alt H you can um, bring back this, those hidden objects and why I'm doing this is to, to select all the individual parts then select the empty and click Ctrl P uh, parent that is object and keep transform do the same process for each wheels and then let me just do it very quickly and that's it now we got each wheels parented to their respective empty objects now you can see when we move the main empty uh, you just move the body and by moving the wheel empties you can move the wheels now we need to rename each empty object so uh, there is a uh, you know special naming uh, uh, like procedure for rigging this uh, rigging the car so i'll give these names in the description you can just copy and paste it and so for example i will select my car body and if i copy that then i will click the main empty and rename the active object like my car body and now select the my car wheel front left and click the left empty and cop and paste it then the same process for my car wheel front right click the right empty rename it and paste it do the same process for all the empties so like back wheel left and the back right wheel And now you can see we, we got the all names perfectly added to each empties. Now the last step is drag select all the empties, not the car, just the empties. Then click Shift A, go to Armature, and and click Car Deformation Rig. Now we can see there is a bone added. Just click the Generate uh, button in the Rig Car Add-on, and there we go. We got the 
controls for everything like from suspension to uh, to drifting to like uh, uh, what do you say uh, steering and all those if i try to move the car you can see the the wheels are not rotating and if you want the wheels to rotate all you need all you need to do is just click the uh, button uh, which says wheels on y axis and by clicking it you can see the wheels starts rotating perfectly and that's it so this was the regular car add-on tutorial for the latest version of blender and all the credits goes to the artist jean yan and i will give the link in the description for his channel please check out him he's a great great youtuber i love him and and now uh, if you want you can watch my video i mean i'm just showing how to drift a car it's just a simple way to drift a car and uh, like uh, you can just take it as a bonus uh, tutorial and uh, that's it so so in the meantime i want to, to tell you something like my i'm 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 just a small youtuber i'm just growing i'm trying my level best and i'm almost 1k so i'm like around 900 subscribers and i want you to subscribe or like this video and please share this video with your blender friends and help me grow i'm just almost 1k and uh, just just help me reach 1000 uh, subscribers i will be really really grateful and if you genuinely like my video please show like subscribe and like my videos for upcoming uh, great great tutorials and uh, and like let me just tell you something like my my next uh, coming tutorial will be about graph editing and i'm planning to start a, a graph editing tutorial series uh, which is like a graph editing masterclass and, and and it's going to be a huge project and uh, yeah that's it so let let me tell you one more thing that is there are lots of add-ons for rigging uh, cars like one of the best add-ons i have seen is uh, launch control and uh, but the thing is uh, you can use whatever add-ons you, you want but make sure you try every add-ons and stick to one which works for you like for like for me uh rigor card add-on works best when you want full manual control but if you are going for a large scale car chasing scenes i prefer you go for launch control because launch control has much much more uh, properties uh, controls like even drift marks and and uh, lights and like uh, headlights and more more perfect ground sensors and yeah that's it so let, uh, let's wind up this video so once again you are watching k and k visual productions i'm karthik and i'm signing off see you in the next video until then take care